All right, so I installed a pressure gauge in my cooling system. You can see the gauge to the right of the steering wheel just to monitor how the cooling system pressure behaves under normal operation, uh, when the coolant's cold, when the coolant warms up, and then also when I'm driving gently and when I'm driving harder when the vehicle gets into boost because I have um, I've seen some symptoms where it appears the cooling system is being pressurized uh, and it seems like it's happening when the vehicle is being driven hard when it's under boost. Uh, before I pull the head gasket, before I pull the head off and change the head gasket and inspect the head, just trying to confirm this once and for all. So um, this is the best I've been able to do and I will show what's happening here. Hopefully you can see the gauges pretty well. So we'll start this guy. This is the first time I'm starting it today. It's, uh, it's cold out. It's like 35, 40 degrees. All right, so I'm gonna let it warm up in the driveway for five minutes or so. Then I'm gonna go drive it around to get it fully up to temperature. Um, once it's fully up to temperature and everything's stabilized, the pressure on the gauge is stabilized, the temperature is stabilized. Oh, I realize you can't quite see that shoot. Anyway, um, I'll talk through it. And once everything's stabilized, I'll drive normally. And then I'll drive a little bit harder where I'm in boost and um, see what happens. All right, I'll check back in. All right, so now I'm driving to get the temperature up. The temperature's about 150 degrees, and the pressure in the system is just over five PSI, according to this gauge. We'll keep driving, get it up to temperature fully, let it stabilize, and see what happens. So we've been up to temperature for a little bit, a little bit over 180, and I'm on a hill right now. I'm gonna floor it, watch the pressure gauge. So the pressure was holding steady around 10 PSI. The temperature was holding steady at say 190, 195, and when I drive calmly, the pressure doesn't change, but when I get in a boost, the pressure goes up and up and up. I saw this before, I'm trying to replicate it now. I'm on the throttle again, and the pressure goes up again. Not in a good place to get on the throttle, so we're gonna find a better road to do this. All right, I'm on another hill. So the temperature is still stable. Now I'm gonna get on the throttle. Here's what my very simple test setup looks like. All I did was pop this hose off of here and put a T in line. And this hose just runs to the gauge inside. 
So, actually didn't spit any coolant just now. Oh, it's got just a little bit. Sometimes it sprays all over the engine bay though. 